Daniel Jones, he's not it. He's not the answer for the Giants. You know, Saquon Barkley was the answer, but, you know, they got rid of him. Man. I don't know what to say, man. We paid the wrong guy. We paid the wrong guy. Once you're in New York, you should never leave New York for some Especially now Philly. Philly. New Especially York or nowhere. What are you going to do? Eat a fucking cheesesteak, Saquon? <laughs> What's up, everybody? My name is Julian. I'm covering for Will this week, who wasn't able to make it here for the Giants game where they just dropped to the Cincinnati Bengals 17-7, bringing the record to 2-4. and four. Cincinnati with a big win. They also go up to 2-4 and four now. Uh, we're going to talk to some fans, see what they have to say. This was a big game for the Giants. This really would have helped them catch up and stay even, but a couple of crucial fourth downs that they couldn't convert on couple of missed kicks. Giants, their third loss of the season at MetLife Stadium. They've yet to win at the stadium. They did, however, score their first touchdown of the year here at home. So we're going to talk to some fans and see what they got to say. What's good, world? It's Will Monesteam here with Fango Media, giving the fans a voice. And we are outside of MetLife Stadium. I flew all the way from Sweden, and it sucked. You flew all the way from Sweden? Yeah. What? Why? Yeah. Just to watch this game. Just all of you? No, 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 no just no. me. I just met these guys, uh, and the thing is, like, I flew all the way, and it sucked. Like, yeah, not the best game I watched. You watch a lot of NFL? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. And did you meet these guys here today? Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I did. <laughs> pretty much. Yeah, yeah pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> and man, again, a disappointment. <laughs> Another yeah. disappointment of a game. Well, you're just showing how much of a diehard fan you really are. You're here at back-to-back -back games. We have all season right. tickets, so you know I gotta come. Right. You know, I, I show up every time, you know, but, you know, on, the only wins we've gotten this season were away. So. Yes, yes, and they finally scored a touchdown they at home. They scored a touchdown at home, but at the end of the day, they didn't win. No, so, no, no. So, you know, there's not much. <laughs> there's not much we can do about that. Danny Jones is getting paid $150 million, and he can't throw a fucking spiral. Dude, <laughs> I, I am so upset. They should have won this game, and it was not okay. It was not okay, and I'm going to keep it at the Keep it to that instead of choice words. <laughs> it is not okay. Cincinnati's defense wasn't that good as they played tonight. No, no, no. not at all. We we should have had a better offense, and it was just it was just not okay. And I'm gonna keep it at that. The Giants I suck. The Giants suck. Okay. They need to fire Brian Dable. He's yeah. the worst. It's time. He's the worst. Move He's on. The worst, worst coach in the league. You think it's time to move on? been time to move on. He stinks. What if they beat the Eagles next week? What do you think? They they're not gonna beat the Eagles. They don't beat division opponents. Wow, you got anything you want to say to the Eagles? Well, the Eagles suck. Jalen Hurts sucks. Nick Sirianni sucks. Hey, it's embarrassing, man. Like, the defense played great. Offense, I, I don't know, man. Jones is, is up there. Man. Like, uh, we should be driving. And Greg Joseph missed field goal. Yep. Sucks. It sucks. What do you think about them not being able to score touchdowns at home? They finally got one tonight. But it, but it's they should have carved up this defense. You're playing the 31st-ranked defense tonight. And Dallas, same thing a couple weeks ago. 32nd, I think. Uh, run defense like this is horrible like you 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 got to expose them and this is it, it makes me embarrassed like to come here tonight i'll come to every game now don't worry about that <laughs> you're gonna come back though <laughs> every, every night every night every night I, I still believe in blue i love it win or loss doesn't matter all three giants home games this season yeah so I, I, I was loving it i was like i'm gonna go to all the games gonna be good defense gonna ball out offense gonna ball out right. danny dimes come back later the year this game i witnessed my first home touchdown i was so hyped and our kicker missed two field goals had me genuinely crying in my seats i want a refund now they showed her yeah but they're hurt they're everything listen this seems not that bad no I'll no you. no two and four they should be they, they, they should have a better record than that absolutely i really just want to win at home i want us to stuff saquon i want our d-line to show saquon he shouldn't have left the team I don't know if it's going to happen. Saquon, your bummy ass got me seven points on fantasy this week. I hate you. I almost lost. Tell me, what do you think about Saquon next week here? How do you think the reception is going to be? Woo. <laughs> he's he's going to have a lot of Eagles fans behind him because the, 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 the Eagle fans from down South Jersey, they're going to really, really come up for him. They're going to come up. Yep. They're going to come up and they're going to crowd the stadium next week. So it's, it's going to be... It's going to be a rough crowd next week. What would you have done different if you were the New York Football Giants? Um, I feel like the defense didn't didn't really work hard enough. The defense didn't work hard enough, man. The uh, they didn't go after the QB. First quarter, they let Burrow go all the way to the end zone with no 
protection. They let him just walk right by. Yep, yep. Walked right in. Walked right in. Missed tackles. You know. And when at home, it's depressing. Our, your fans are getting diminished. I'm being diminished. My spirits are in the ground right now. You should bring my spirits up. You know what I'm saying? Season Earth. ticket holder. I want to come to these games and be satisfied. I don't want to see two missed kicks. There's more Bengals fans behind me than Giants fans. I'm getting flamed by Bengals fans. Like, they're not one and four. But two and four now. Whatever. That can't happen. Can't happen. Can't happen. All right, I just wanted to let it be known. Micah McFadden, defensive player of the year. Micah McFadden. That's yeah, my dog. He good. That's my dog. Daniel Jones is awful. Never let Daniel Jones be on this team again. Please give me Arch Manning in the next year. Let's go, Bengals. Who day? Screw the Giants. The Giants are terrible. We are never going to win a game again with Daniel Jones as quarterback. We're done. Watch this. Okay. I'm his mom. And he just lost his Christmas present. So, but Mude, <laughs> yes, you can be a Fairweather fan, even though it was a terrible game. It was awful. Next week, you think everyone's going to boo Saquon? It's going to be like Kyrie in like the finals last year. You know what I'm saying? Everyone was booing him. I don't know. Personally, I don't have anything against Saquon Barkley. I was a little kid watching Odell Beckham Jr. in the stadium throwing passes to Saquon. He's always going to have a spot in my heart. I was fucked up that he went to the Eagles, though. I don't like the Eagles. I Nick Sirianni. I think I was mad childish what you did to the fans today. That's what I'm saying. That's true. That's true. Well, they were the only division team that won today. So, Well, you know. I mean, the Commanders played a great game. They did. Lamar just... They did. Also so, if the, if points. you think if they beat the Eagles here next week, there's a shot they can win the division? Yes. I think that's what we need in terms of hope. I think in terms of if we don't win that game, I think we're going to go into a downward spiral. I think if we win that game, we won, we won our away games against Seattle. Beautiful game. Daniel Jones had a great game. One against, um, who we won against? The Browns. Great yeah. game. I was in my room screaming at my laptop. I was like having a great time. I come to the games. I'm getting hyped. Sunday night. I went to the Thursday night game. Just can't make it happen. Can't make it happen. Gotta win at home. As I was walking through the stadium and through the parking lot, I must have got stopped and asked about this thing at least like 20 times to 25 <laughs> times tonight. I mean, one, one guy sitting next to me in the, uh, in the stands offered me like $5,000 and $10,000 <laughs> to buy this thing. I said, no, my wife would kill me. <laughs> well, there you go. We'll tell the world right now. Uh, five grand, ten grand, not having it, man. No, this no, is... no. It's definitely not definitely not for sale. Uh, this was a gift from my wife, and she would not let me in the house tonight. <laughs> yeah, Daniel Jones played well tonight. All right, I thought he did. Yep. The defense played well. A lot of sacks, and good most sacks in the NFL. Yep. Wide receivers need to catch the ball and finish their routes. That was the main thing I saw from tonight. But they played well. They need a kicker. They make that field goal. They probably win that game. And they were missing a lot of pieces. They yeah. were missing Singletary, yeah. missing neighbors. Yeah, neighbors, man. Yeah, even neighbors in that game and cave on them. It's a wrap. Do you think that it's an issue now, neighbors missing two games? Um, no, not yet. Uh, he's, he's young. We want him to be healthy for a long time. So there's no reason to risk it, you know. There you it's, go. It's a longevity game in the NFL. It's not a It's not a week, one week here, one week there, you know. There you go. Saquon Barkley's he's a f***ing snake. Like, tell the Saquon Barkley. Got a new jersey. Devin oh! Single. Devin single. He's illiterate, by the way. He's illiterate. Devin Sigourie. Got a new jersey. Saquon Barkley, he's a snake. He's a f***ing uh, snake. He's going to play like uh, next Happy Breast Cancer Awareness Month. All right, guys. That's going to be it from us here at Fango Media Life Stadium here in East Rutherford, New Jersey. Don't forget to follow us. Uh, subscribe to the channel. Uh, it really helps us grow. You know, we're a small independent company. We want to make sure that we give all these voices a place to be, a place to be heard. And, uh, you know, your support, following, liking, sharing with your friends, sharing with fellow football fans will really help us grow tremendously. Giants are here next week against the Eagles. Huge, huge divisional game. That is for sure a must win game for the New York Giants if they want to have a chance of possibly winning this division which is up for grabs. Go ahead and uh, click on click on this video right here. Yeah, that one to uh, see some other fan reaction videos. Thank you so much.